This week we have been researching how to keep germs away. Uh, a few days ago we used a map to help us organize our ideas and yesterday we began by making a title that was going to grab our readers and creating our topic sentence, our central idea. Keeping germs away helps people stay healthy. Now on day three we created a map with our details. Now, our topic sentence, keeping germs away, is that very first sentence. Now we need to make sentences that use our details. How many sentences do you think I might need to include three details? You're right, I need at least three. I'm gonna have a sentence for this detail, a sentence for this one, in a sentence here. So let's see how we did. Keep those germs away. Keeping germs away helps people stay healthy. These are the ideas I thought of. Tell me what you think. One way to keep germs away is by washing your hands before you eat. Is that a detail? Yes. Let's keep going. Another way is to use a tissue when you sneeze or blow your nose. Yes, that's another detail we researched. Also, make sure not to touch your eyes or nose when you are sick. That's our third detail. Then, my last sentence I made so that it wraps up everything that we're trying to say. So I said, that is the easiest way to spread germs. What's the easiest way to spread germs? Touching your eyes and nose. So for this detail, I used two sentences. If everyone follows these tips, we can really help keep people from getting sick. Now let's read the whole thing without stopping. Make sure it makes sense. Keep those germs away. Keeping germs away helps people stay healthy. One way to keep germs away is by washing your hands before you eat. Another way is to use a tissue when you sneeze or blow your nose. Also, make sure not to touch your eyes or nose when you are sick. That is the easiest way to spread germs. If everyone follows these tips, we can really keep people from getting sick. Did we include everything we needed to? Did we include our topic? Did we remind people to wash their hands, use a tissue, and not to touch their eyes or nose? We did. Great job. Next week, we're going to see if we can't add some details.